When was the last time you were at a pumpkin patch? It's Angela Sharp here with SCL TV. And I gotta tell you, I have not been to a pumpkin patch since I was a tiny kid, but apparently they've become something much bigger than they were back when we were little, right? Now there's bouncy houses and a pumpkin patch, a corn maze, even a haunted corn maze. Plus a lot of places where you could grab something sweet to eat. We all know that I have candy, candy, ice cream. They've got that. Um, adults, they even sell beer here. I'm here at Brookdale Farms and I'm gonna show you what it's all about in 2020 at a pumpkin patch. makes a perfect pumpkin. Do you think it is the stem? I like these stems that are kind of curvy. I, so do you like the round pumpkin? Or do you like more of like the Ernie, Bert and Ernie heads? Like the Ernie head. Or Ernie's round, Bert is tall. Which pumpkin do you like? Which one is better? I like the round ones better. So the perfect pumpkin for me has one of these things, but it's rounder. I do like the color of this one. I also like those white ones a lot too. What's the perfect pumpkin? I caught up with Jerry Kirk, the owner here at Brookdale Farms. I'm so excited to be here. I hear so much about Brookdale Farms. Do you believe this is my first time here? I'm sorry that it is. I've I know. I wish you would have made it here long, way, way long time way ago. Way before. Yeah. So kind of give me kind of the Cliff Notes version of what kind of fun you guys have here at Brookdale Farms for the Halloween pumpkin season. Well, so what's great about this place is it transforms from daytime to nighttime. So during the day, we're open from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., Wednesday through Sunday, and we're family friendly. We have, we have uh, all kinds of stuff for the kids to do. We have the inflatables, we have a pumpkin patch, we have hay rides, petting zoo, pony rides, camel rides. Of course, our corn maze, we have the biggest corn maze in St. Louis, it's 18 acres this year. This is insane. And you guys always do some sort of really cool like design in the corn maze. Yeah, so this year the design, uh, the design shows healthcare workers. And so, and we're thanking the healthcare workers for all their hard work during this, during the pandemic. So um, that, that was our theme for the corn maze this year. Uh, we made it extra big for social distancing. So during the day, you can come out with your family and the kids can run and pl uh, play, have fun. We have, uh, we have a couple different places for food. This year we added, we have an ice cream shop this year. So we have a lot of really fun stuff during the day. And then at night on Fridays and Saturdays, we transform the place into the fear farm and it becomes a haunted hayride in the haunted corn maze. Ooh. So that's, uh, that's a lot, a lot of fun at night. And, and weddings, you also have weddings. Yes, we have, our, we have our wedding and event center. So we have weddings um, probably every weekend now, this time of year, we're, uh, um, we're every weekend, basically we've had the weddings going on for about four or five years. Um, and then we have other events. We have national events that come through and use the farm for their place, uh, for, for, to show off their places like um, Big Bounce America has been here, uh, the Water Lantern Festival, the Lantern Festival, uh, different, so different traveling events come here and, and come and use our property. So how does it go, um, without telling me the prices, how does it work? You, you buy a ticket for the, each event? You know, well, actually, so the daytime and the nighttime are two separate events, those okay. are the only difference, but all our uh, daytime events are basically inclusive other than if you buy a pumpkin or if you wanna do the pony rides. All the other activities are all included in, the, in, our, in our price to get into the farm, and you just come and park your car, get in the ticket booth, and away you go. And there's one thing we probably should mention to everybody who's watching at home thinking about making way out here. It's cash only. Cash only, correct. So that is very important. Make sure you have your cash when you come out here to Brookdale Farms. What kind of fun can I get into today for Angela's adventures? Well, we've got all kinds of fun things. I think maybe our new slide might be one of the Ooh, new Angela adventures. Okay. Yeah, that's what, um, and we wanted to get a bigger slide, but there isn't one. That's the biggest slide you can get. So. It is really, I, I, when I turn to look at it, it is actually a lot taller than I thought it was when we were driving down the street. So uh, yeah. It's, it's a big one. And then we have our big bounce pad too. That's that's something new this year too. That's uh, the kids are loving that thing. That big pumpkin over there. It's uh, it's almost three three thousand square feet of jumping. Whoa! All right. So there's a lot for me to get into. So I'm gonna go and explore Brookdale Farms. But tell people where they can find out information about all the events you have coming up. Sure. Uh, well, our website's obviously the best place. It's www.brookdalefarmsinc.com. And that'll tell you all, our, all of our upcoming events. It'll, it'll list everything that's going on here at the farm. You can actually sign up for our newsletter. And then as new events come along, we'll, we'll email you and let you know about different things that we've got going on here. 
Wonderful. All right. Well, thank you so much, Jerry. Let's go. Let's go have some fun. You bet. All right. So you guys, uh, Jerry told me about the giant slide. It's right here. I feel like I should go up. Travis, let's go. Are you ready? I'm ready. Here we go. Woo! That's so much fun. I'm like a giant child here. <laughs> looks crazy. I'm, Jerry hasn't quite told me what it is, but um, it is built by Hold My Beer and Watch This Productions. Okay, look, he's got that. He's putting that into this black thing right here. I, I don't know what's going to happen. Come back over here. Okay, come back over here. Who knew that pumpkin patches would turn into all this? Okay, you're ready. I'm ready? I shoot it? Yep. Okay, ready? Here we go! <laughs> Yes, it ran right in the lake. That is so fun. There's a lot here at Brookdale Farms. There's even a mechanical bull. You guys have to make your way out here. Get your pumpkins. For SCL TV, I'm Angela Sharp. <laughs>